Well, there's the old rock too, doing good at 90,000. I'll show you something on the brake in a minute. Anyway, I've come over here to see what this reprobate is doing. He's over here Working playing in his shop, his new shop. Working as usual. As usual. Trying to get her done. He's through with the major construction. Well, you didn't put trim around that door, sir. Not through yet. You're going to be painting here. I'll be up for part painting. Okay, I'm just checking on you. You've been so what did you do? She fit. Well, originally this was all going to be open. Yeah. You came to your senses and you enclosed it at the last minute. Yeah. And are you glad you did that? Yeah. So I was right. I'll yeah. give you that one. Okay. So you Put OSB on the ceiling, the walls, and you put you some pegboard up on this side. Yep. Got plenty of plugs everywhere. Got, plugs. Got a garage door that's real close to the top. Yeah, I don't even know if I could put an opener on it. Uh, I like 11 inches, I don't think I have that. I mean, seven inches, I'm not sure it's really close. You may be it. able to. I thought this was coming with a shaft one. I was going to put a jack shaft opener. And yeah. I ran an electrical cord over there in the corner. But no. He came with a spring. I think they make a low profile. We might work on that. I'll, I'll see what my distributor has for you. Probably a big fat no. Probably. It's pretty close. So this wall used to be the original outside and a garage door in it, and this was all going to be open. But then you changed your mind, luckily. Because the price of wood came down so much. Yeah. Stupid not to do it. And I don't know that wall being there such a big hindrance anyway with that door opening the way it it's does. Not, it's not bad and then it gives me some extra wall space here right now for yeah. so. How old are you? Seventy. Seventy years old and you did every bit of it yourself. It keeps me young. It's wore out. Doesn't do anything for your smell, but it does for your age. Yeah, I sweat a lot. And you came in here and you took a, a grinder and you ground everything smooth on the edges. Yeah. This isn't the most dimensionally accurate no. equipment or uh, material. And now you're caulking it all with elastomeric caulk. It's just a garage, but I just can't stand it. You're wanting to texture it now. You <laughs> just keep finding things to do to it. Yeah, well, I've got a texture gun, so it's going to take me about 30 minutes to texture. Then it's hard to wipe down. Can't you clean it off. How often do you wipe down your shirt? I do mine every 23 years, every whether it needs years. it or not. Yeah. Like here, I'll show you an example. This is, what it, this is what it looks like when you don't do that. See that joint there? That's what it would all look like if I didn't grind it. It's kind of hard to see on a camera. Yeah. Come from this angle, you can see it. That shadow, probably. Yeah, you can really notice it, but then once I, if you, you'd follow my suggestion and go get you a bunch of girly tool posters, we wouldn't be noticing your fixture, your finish. You don't see those very much anymore in businesses. No, not correct. It's not correct. 
Well, this door goes out to your last year's edition, yeah. which was going to be like this one is, but now you've fixed it. Your bird's still going up there? Yep. Yeah. Third crop? Yep. Yeah. You got a hornet's nest up yeah. there. Yeah, that's too high up at the bottom. Too high up. Okay. They'll come down here and bite you on the ass and you'll be going. Yeah, don't bite me for some reason. <laughs> I wouldn't bite you either. This is going to be the grinding, everything grinding. Everything okay. grinding. Yeah. This will be, everything's coming out of here except the grinders, the mid saw, and that. Everything else is coming out. So I have plenty around here. Make your own. This is coming out, this one in there. This death mobile. I'm not dead yet, am I? Even though I'm retired, my fellow paramedics thank you for their continued job security. I'm not, I've driven a bike for 60 years. I know. I'm not dead yet. It's what they put on some people's graves. Well, I mean, you know, people drive cars and die. I mean, you know. So those are the lights you're putting in the other one also. Yeah. Okay. I never even looked at the, the course to the ceiling yet. And, but it works. So. It's bright in here. Bright enough. Bright enough. Bright enough. Well, I think you're going to enjoy it. Yeah. You get rid of those birds over there. If they quit making babies, you can paint all this. It's, they're almost done. I think three crops is probably the most they're going to do this year. I counted them the other day. It was over 50 of them on the... Um, uh, fourth in the line Swallows. Well, this makes me jealous. My wife won't let me add on. You just gotta put your foot down, buddy. <laughs> Famous last words. You've been married how many times? <laughs> I just don't let them run over me. Uh, and they don't want to stay at there. <laughs> Oh. Now I got more money than I've ever had in my life, so there you go. So you can adopt me? Yeah, all right. Be cheaper to rent away than have one. <laughs> all right, well, I think you did a good job. Yeah, Tied in nice with the rest of the building. He threw you some asphalt you had left over from road repair down here. Yep. And I can't step on it because I sink into it I just yet. I wanted to let it sit before I tucked it in with it. So now you got a... It's 2,200 square feet total. How much? 2,200 square feet. 2,200. About the size of an average house. Not in Russia. No. Then it's still got... During Stalin's time, they had like 80 square meters it's or 80 got, square feet or something like that. It's storage container full too. Yeah. Oh, well. Thanks for letting us watch it. Anytime. A lot of work. Yeah, it's worth it. All right, see y'all later.